Nearly two years after a crash sent three teenagers to the hospital, Madison County neighbors say the congested intersection where that crash happened has only gotten worse. On top of that, plans to add a stoplight have been pushed back. Fox 59's Eric Graves checked in with those neighbors and also asked NDOT what changed in those plans. Every rush hour, cars go racing by on State Road 13 as traffic waits in lines on County Road 800, just looking for a sliver of a window to get out onto 13. Neighbors in this area have been asking for a stoplight at this intersection for years. Even INDOT documents show this intersection getting one of the worst grades INDOT gives in terms of congestion. I tell everyone I love that they are not allowed to come to 813. The intersection of County Road 800 and State Road 13 in Madison County has long been a concern for the neighbors around it. It is complete congestion and everybody says it's like playing a game of Frogger. Carrie Ashley and other neighbors first came to Fox 59 with their concerns in November of 2021 when a crash at the intersection hurt three teenagers. Now, almost two years later, the intersection has just gotten worse. We have so much growth here that it's just nonstop traffic in the mornings and in the afternoons. Back in 2020, NDOT studied this intersection. These documents show it got the second to worst grade in terms of congestion for intersections, saying it's only going to get worse. Few people know that congestion better than local bus driver David Goff. It would be like driving downtown Indianapolis with no stoplights. For the last two years, he's watched these neighborhoods grow by the hundreds of houses, all while navigating an even busier intersection. Cars are stopped. We got a lines of traffic down 800, 10, 15 cars deep. Relief was supposed to be coming this year. When we talked to NDOT in late 2021, a spokesperson said a stoplight would be added to the intersection in 2023, something Ashley says they need. A stoplight just to get people to and from the elementary school safely. I would just be tickled to death. <laughs> but NDOT says unforeseen complications have pushed those construction plans back to the spring of 2024. It's just about winding up the lanes, making sure, again, the utilities um, are all there and ready to go. Kylie Kramer with NDOT says the project is expected to cost just more than $2 million. In Madison County, Eric Graves, Fox 59 News. Eric, thank you. People